Our A6 is gonna be the biggest of all of our one bedrooms. So when you walk in, you still have your coat closet right there to the left for you. And then this one has some separation. This is your living room, your kitchen, and then your dining room kind of around the corner. It creates a little bit of a designated space. I love this true island set up here. You've got a lot of countertop space. You also have this corner area with a lot of cabinets. If you are big into cooking and you've got a lot of appliances, this kitchen is perfect. You can easily put stand mixers, doors, foreman, all that good stuff in here. This dining room does not necessarily have to be dining. I know they're kind of dying out, so it would also be a really good study nook, an office, maybe a gamer's pad, something like that for you. You have your stainless steel appliances, gas range, oven, and stove for you. Down this hallway, you do have your laundry room right here. You'll have side-by-side -side units. There are two really long shelves built in above these. And then if you go further back, that's your master. But this is the study, and I kind of want to show this to you. So even though we've called this a study, this room does fit a queen size bed quite easily in here with some extra furniture. And then you do get a closet space set up for you. You've got your sliding mirror doors. And then there is shelving in here as well as bar work. So you can actually hang your clothes like you would normally in any other closet. All right, let's take a look at the master. When you go one door down, you walk into a very expansive room. You're probably wondering why I've got little plants on the floor here. They are a way for you to kind of see what a king, queen, and then full would look like. At the back, you've got your king. In the middle, you have your queen, and then you have your full up here. The king basically fits perfectly between these two windows. Keep in mind, a bed frame does make it a little bit bigger. But you can really put a lot in here. Do a dresser, a bookshelf, end table, stuff like that. I love the way that our closet is set up. We have the shorter doors as opposed to one big door, so you don't have to worry about trying to keep your furniture farther away. Your closet is kind of divided into perfect for a his and her situation. You've got the shelf in the middle, right for shoes, hats, stuff like that. And then on either side, you've got lots of bar work and additional shelving. Perfect. Now this is a one bedroom, so there's one bathroom in it. You do get two sinks though, so you have a nice big vanity space, lots of cabinets and drawers. You have your normal shower tub combo going on here. What's nice about this bathroom is it does have two points of entry. If you're standing in one, if you come around the corner, here is another. And then this is where your linen closet is as well. Awesome, let's head back to the living room. Again, with all of our units, we do have a really nice patio space. You do have your outside storage that's standard across all the apartments. And then this, as a quick reminder for you, is our A6 apartment or our one bedroom with a study. If you have any questions, give me a call. Thanks.